Hello YouTube, Apple recently sent out their October 22nd event invitations and in this video I'm going to be covering some things that may be seen at this event. Let's get to it. Now earlier today, Apple announced that they will be hosting an event on Apple 22nd and there's the invitation picture sitting right there as you can see in the background and under it, it says that we still have a lot to cover and usually when Apple has these events, they usually hide something and make it a little hint in the invitation that they send and we usually think about something that is revealed in the hint itself but in this one I just really can't get anything soldier knows best he said something like a smart cover for your ipad to make it charge and do new things but from this i can't get anything from it except that they're announcing a whole lot of new things at this event that's what i'm getting from it now at this event i think that they're going to be announcing the things like the ipad mini because the iPad Mini has came out about a year ago and now this year Red Spectrum needs to have the Retina display and if, if you do get the Retina display you will obviously have to have your iPad Mini to be thicker but I think that it's much needed since the Retina display will make, make it much better because the iPad Mini is my favorite tablet. I don't know if it's just me but the iPad Mini is just the best tablet out there. I know the Nexus 7 is a great competitor but Apple and iOS for an iPad, I think that's the best way to go. So the iPad Mini it may have new colors. It probably might go the way that the iPhone iPhone 5C did, like getting colors, colorful colors like blue, red, and all that. But it might also go the way that the iPhone 5S when they have colors like space gray and things like that. Also at WWDC, they talked about OS X Mavericks, which is their new OS for the Macs. And they might be releasing that and giving it a price, which probably will be $29.99 like most of the OS's are for new releases. And yeah, this has actually been available. Like, there have been ways you can go around to getting it, but it haven't been officially just put out for the public now. And I think they're going to be talking about that near the beginning of it since it isn't all that big. And they're going to leave the things like the iPad Mini to talk about last. Also at WWDC, they talked about the new Mac Pros that are coming out because many people are interested in the Mac Pros. Now, me, myself, I'm not interested in Mac Pro. I have my Hackintosh here for $600, and I think that the Mac Pro will go about $2,000, so that is a little bit extreme for me. But some people are interested in that. They might release the release date, and they might release the price for that. So it's coming. I think it might come. I'm pretty sure it would since they talked about it, and they said that they will be coming this fall, and this fall now, so... About time. Now, also going along with the iPad Mini, they might be releasing the new, new iPad. Like you know, they released the iPad 4, but me, I never really got into that. So they might be releasing the new iPad or the the iPad 5. I don't know if they're gonna call it the iPad 5. That just sounds like a weird name to me. But the iPad 5, they might release that. It's probably gonna be looking better, like going towards the way that the iPad Mini looks with the space gray version. Uh, that would look pretty sick. A space gray iPad. Mm. Yeah, that'll look pretty cool. They might just go the way that the iPad Mini is, or they might be changing the iPad Mini to go the way that the iPad is, which is, I don't recommend that Apple. Apple, stop it. So yeah, they might be releasing that. I won't be surprised if they do. And also, just some little small thing that they might release. They might release some new iPods, like a new iPod Nano. I actually have mine over there, the sixth generation, because I think that's the best one. They might be even release the uh, Apple iWatch. It's possible. They might release the new Apple TV, not the TV itself, but the Apple TV, the little device that you hook up via HDMI to your TV and stream from there. They might introduce a new one of those. Just some things that they might introduce. I'm going to be doing a recap video since I can't do a live stream because I do believe I'll be at school when this event is happening. Too bad. But I'm ready for this. This is what I've been waiting for. You guys saw that I really wasn't into it with the iPhone 5S and the iPhone 5C, but this is what I'm interested in, guys. So I will be doing a recap when this event happens. So stay tuned for that. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you hit the like button down below. I really appreciate it. Subscribe if you haven't already. More videos awesome to come. More videos awesome. That was not English. But yeah, anyways, I'll see you guys in the next one. Deuces, YouTube.